hello guys uh, welcome back this is my boy again adam slink i hope you guys are doing okay uh please enjoy the video and uh, leave your comment below and happy friday so the reason why i'm refusing to show my face uh the reason why i don't want to show my face for this video because i had a shame talking about this particular issue because it involves a man's asshole a man's all and uh, that is bob brisky's all According to a tone to DK recently revealed like a few minutes ago or a few hours ago, depending on, on what time you will be watching this video, Tono DK said that when she was still friends with Bob Brisky, that she used to go to the pharmacy or the chemist to buy cotton wool to help Bob Brisky clean uh, his hole after maybe he has... Uh, he you know, went to a one night stand with another man and the man end up tearing his hole then uh bob Brisky will run to turn to dk and told the dk we will help him use cotton wood to clean his hole because the hole is smelling and dirty that is coming from total dk herself so how all this started was this morning this morning tono dk decided to no, Tondike was not even talking to anybody. Tondike said that some people in Nigeria entertainment industry used to borrow money just to flex on social media, just to show off on social media. That's exactly what Tondike was saying. She didn't mention anybody's name. She never called anybody's name. Honestly, firstly, guys, uh, honestly, guys, uh, I will be completely honest and truthful. Let me say just in this my video i won't uh, shade anyone i will support anyone i will just say my truth the way i see the matter so let me continue so uh what tundu dk wrote today was that some people uh some entertainers are borrowing money from bureau the change from aboki to just flex online she never referred to anyone she said that anybody who is looking out uh, uh who is looking at maybe getting some kind of uh way seeing other celebrities showing off money that that person shouldn't just be lost by seeing people or flexing money or social media that most of our colleagues used to borrow money she never mentioned anybody's name then uh, jane came in the instagram twerker calling out to the dk for running because jane is looking for her to sue her Tonike was so hungry and of course she came out to also uh, bring out that former beef she was having with Jane about Popogiri that Jane was sleeping with Popogiri behind her husband's back. And there's a S tape to prove it. In fact, after that, that was what uh, Tonodike has been ranting about since. Because she made a post, she never called anybody. Jane came into that post. Well, then after the whole thing of uh, Jane Akopogiri and Tolo Dike is still threatening that there's a S tape that she might release it or someone might release it, all this kind of going back and forth. But Brisky came in saying that, uh, you know, indirectly talking to Toto Dike, saying that Toto Dike is the one who is actually doing the borrowing and flexing on social media, living fake life. That Toto Dike one time was evicted and Toto Dike is hoeing her i uh, win him the sum of five million naira all this kind of stuff well tony dk was not really happy with that because i because he has been long that tony dk bob Brisky has been trying as much as possible to get tony dk attention let us be completely honest bob Brisky has been trying to get tony dk attention for a long time now and Toto is not paying attention. Toto does doesn't want to be friends again with bob Brisky, and bob Brisky is not happy with that and Bob Brisky the other day apologized to Toto DK in fact. Toto DK never responded. Now Bob Brisky is coming out again to blast Toto DK again. Come on, man. Pick a side, Bob, and just uh, stay put. Well, I believe Bob Brisky has emptied all his bullet on Toto DK. There's nothing Bob Brisky will say again now that he has not said before about Toto DK. But Tono DK has not said anything. So Tono DK now is not throwing the bullet. So I'm just going to read what uh, Tono DK wrote. Someone said, she said, I respect friendship a lot, but when it goes sour, 
I walk away because whatever I say publicly will never be believed because I was the closest person to them. I try as much as possible to ignore S friends, but Bob, do not push me to the wall. You are the same little boy I will walk into a chemist for to buy cracked but healing cream for your leaking pores filled anus to heal. <laughs> you don't see me coming out to tell everyone that your Bentley belongs to Sele or that you almost killed your ex friend's son with jazz. Or the Rolex watch you parade as Bay bought me is actually mine. Bob, don't let me become a pig like you again. It hurts to lose me, I know. Just move on. You have begged everyone to beg me. I have refused. I never want to be friends with you again. Everything you did, I did more for you. Between you have my jewelries. Who gave me quick notice? Please provide the papers. I have you I have your house just fake ass F. Bring receipt and I will bring the real owner of the house real now. Is it how you say you are sleeping with half the industry? I just don't want to call names so I don't ruin homes. Biggest gossip for man like you. You have overseas petition for stealing from people. You are also a thief. If not for seller, by now you will be rotting in jail and, ha and you have no fear to insult him because he's too so low to relate with you thin. You are an ungrateful hoodlum and I never regret anything in my life but I regret ever knowing you. You are a disappointing as a human being, disgusting as a friend. You are a pathetic liar and dear, and this is the last you will hear from me. I made you who you are today, so I won't be the one to bring you down. Those who are in front, I have served enough. Well, let us be completely honest though. When Bob Brisky came to, um, to light, when, uh, you know, he was up there, no? Nobody was mingling with Bob Brisky. Nobody wanted to associate with Bob Brisky. It was Tun to Dickey that firstly associated with Bob Brisky that made everybody accept Bob Brisky. Let's be completely honest. We shouldn't be just, okay, Tun to Dickey see has our own issues though. But let's be, when it comes to Tun to Dickey versus Bob Brisky, I will tell you wholeheartedly that I believe Bob, Bob Brisky is the one looking for trouble. Honestly. Tun to Dickey, in some way, made Bob Brisky. Nobody was associating with Bob Brisky. Tundu DK bring brought out Bob Brisky to the public. Well now Bob Brisky the only issue Bob Brisky is, uh, is saying that he, he has, he's having with Tundu DK was that Tundu DK ended their friendship because he refused to give Tundu DK the sum of five million naira that she was asking for for a favor from Bob Brisky. Bob Brisky refused to give her so the reason why all this is just coming is that I believe it's just from jealousy, from jealousy and hate from uh, uh, from Bob Risky because Bob Risky is a really good friend with Tony Dickey and it's kind of like hot that Tony Dickey will just hand their relationship without thinking twice. And Bob Risky don't know why because he refused to assist Tony Dickey. Well. They are still going back and forth, calling out each other. But the one that freaks me out the most is what uh, Tundu DK said, that he, she has been helping Bob Brisky to clean her hole after being banged by men. Kai, now wow. But honestly, I don't see how Bob Brisky can actually deny that because ordinarily, that a manhole is not a place to put any pecker. Let's be completely honest. And if you put pecker constantly, it will surely leak. So I don't see how Bob Brisky can deny it. Though Bob Brisky might deny that Tony DK never helped him to clean his hole. But the honest truth is that Bob Brisky's numerous occasions came out to say, see, 
is banging a lot of men in the entertainment industry and nobody can do anything about that. He also said that uh, he's sleeping with a lot of uh, married men out there and nobody can do anything about that. So there's nothing that he can actually come out to deny. I saw everything on his page and I see that, okay, uh, he's still hammering on the fact of uh, on the uh, property papers and also the 5 million naira. That is the only thing. So kind of leave a comment below, guys, and uh, tell me exactly how you feel about the situation. Like I've said before, I feel like shame showing my face analyzing this issue because it involves a man's hole. Come on, I don't want to be talking about a man's hole. Uh, if they would they get us they do me for body safe but uh that is it guys so kindly leave a comment below tell me exactly how you feel tell me who you think is at fault and who is actually saying the truth bye guys